starting to be tracked in the early 80s. What did you like about the offensive flow from the jump? Uh, we were in a great flow. I think um, the ball was popping. Obviously, D'Lo had it going. AR, I believe, started the game, I think, seven for seven or six for six. And, uh, you know, Rui was one of the best offensive performances he had this year. You know, he was just reading the defense, coming behind the defense, also making his outside shots. So, um, good performance for us offensively. You played with a variety of players throughout your career who can score in abundance and find that zone. What about D'Lo when he gets there makes him so unique? Um... I mean, when you have the ability to shoot the ball like that, you're going to always keep the defense at bay. You know, you, they never know if you're going to shoot, if you're going to drive, whatever the case may be. And his, uh, his range is um, um, it's pretty uncanny. And it's only a few guys, obviously, in our league that can come down with the dribble, and, you know, and just race from anywhere. And he's one of those guys. And once he gets going, you know, he can run three or four of them um, in a streak together. I've asked you this a few times this year, and I'm, I'm just maybe trying to see if there's a, a trend to it. As another night when you guys look really strong offensively, when you had double digit assists, and is that will is that part of what you guys can unlock over the final stretch here? Um, yeah, I mean, for me personally, I'm always looking to get my teammates involved, and you know, defense shifts towards me. I'm always trying to pick apart the defense with the pass. That's just, I mean, that's. That is my DNA when it comes to basketball. So, um, but obviously we got we have a lot of ball handlers too. So the ball is not always in my hands, which is okay. You know, AR hands the ball, D'Lo handles the ball, AD handles the ball. Um, you know, I think you know with Skies minutes he's been playing well. He's handling the ball too. So, um, but tonight worked well for us, and um, you know I was happy the guys was able to finish them. Brown, having a five starters and 20 plus points is obviously pretty rare. Um, what, what type of offensive rhythm have you seen from U5 over the last few games as you kind of come together? Um, no, I can. I mean, tonight was pretty good. I mean, last night wasn't a great offense, but yeah. Um, yeah, no D Low and, uh, you know, uh, Rui had a, a, a tough one. Uh, we, had, we had, you know, a tough offensive you know, game yesterday. But, um, but tonight, you know, we. Really, Left yesterday where it was and left it behind as they moved on to today. And you know, I love the way we perform. LeBron, um, it's rare to see like kind of an open recruitment in season. We saw Spencer Dinwiddie with Rob during the game, saw him back here afterwards. Um, he's a free agent. What do you think he could add to this team? Um, playmaking, another ball handler, another shot maker, another guy, um, another veteran. Um, anytime you can add a veteran uh, with that ability, it helps. Um, so we see what happens. That last basket is the secondary defender came over in CJ and that left Austin a little over.